Mayor Greg Davis is under investigation by the state and the FBI accused of misusing more than $100,000 of taxpayer money. Even though he hasn't been indicted and claims he's never misspent funds, residents are wasting no time to kick him out of office. We have 60 days from today's date to complete this mission. That mission removes South Haven Mayor Greg Davis from office. Today we're organizing our petition drive to which we need 30% of the registered voters. That's according to Mississippi law. For that to happen, the group will have to collect 10,000 signatures. Then it's up to the governor to determine the mayor's fate. People couldn't wait to sign the petition. This wasting of money that he's done is just doesn't make sense. And I think it's time for him to go. People can do whatever they want to, but for the good or the bad, when you're in the public eye, you should be held to a certain standard. And I just don't feel like that's being met. There are reports the South Haven Chamber of Commerce paid Mayor Davis $207,000 over six years for dinners, trips, parties, and gifts without requiring receipts. It just kind of rubs me, you know, wrong to see someone living, you know, lavish like that off of taxpayers' money. The mayor also received a $2,700 longevity stipend, $5,000 for education expenses, all that on top of the mayor's $145,000 salary. They're tired of the, uh, the way uh, things are happening around South Haven and the mess that we're in. We're optimistic that once we deliver this petition, to the governor that um, justice will prevail and we will have a new mayor. Greg Davis has repaid $96,000 but still owes nearly $63,000. Now Mississippi auditors are looking at thousands more of the city's money. The state is in the process of a second investigation. The auditor's office has not determined when they'll know exactly how much more money Davis owes. Jackie Orozco, ABC 24 News.